making old man noises as I'm trying to lean over to the trash can. Hey everybody, old man Paul here having fun on the Game of Tron. How you all doing? Let's see, we got uh, Pants McGee over here, Lexi. What's she doing? She's reading Point Farmer, the story of Grant Rodiak. D -d -d Dick, who got promoted recently to a traffic cop, is sleeping. Don't you honk at me, you whore. Denise is sleeping. <clears throat> Nikki's sleeping. She uh, recently stayed work doing some investigative journalism or some shit. And Toby's sleeping at the art museum after a date with some chick. Wait, no, he's not. All right, he's... Going, going to work? Why is there a cop? Oh, that's not good. Hello, Chuck Wobble. Don't bother me. Wait, my... Wait. Oriel, you can't come with me. Oh, no. That's the girl we were on the date with. That's not gonna be a good look when you bring your date to work. Wait, wait who's this other girl? Just the same way. Oh, my God. Maybe the boss will think she's her hooker and we'll be fine. Toby, who'd you bring? Oh, it's just one of the hookers. Okay. <laughs> It's the prostitutes that work for me. Toby is very tired at work. Jam, yeah, Poopra, please. <laughs> Did the officer come here to serenade the crime? Is it because we keep him in a job? It makes me think of my guitar. My guitar doesn't look garish like that, though. I was, I was working on it yesterday. I'm sure that's what you wanted to hear. Man, I had a long day. I want to watch Super Paul and have fun. No, you're going to hear my old man's stories about fixing my guitar, and I had over-adjusted the truss rod, but I didn't break it. But I had to uh, loosen it, because otherwise I was having fret buzz. You're welcome. <laughs> oh, I wish you could see inside the work. I can't believe Oriel went to work with him. That or maybe she's a criminal, too? What's Toby got here? He wants to play chess? He wants to watch Wild Horse? He's done that a lot. I don't know why that hasn't clicked through and worked. Visit a graveyard? Oh, THE graveyard. I think last time I just had him visit uh, Chuck's grave. Because I'm very good at reading and paying attention. As any of you who have watched over the years know. <laughs> I don't know how many times people get mad and be like, You read that wrong! You made the wrong decision! You played the game wrong! Mom, quit commenting on my videos, please. I'll play it the way I want. I like how they have these old milk containers here. Well, Officer Chuck, great music. Good job busting us. What's going on back home in the bone zone where nobody gets boned? I feel like we should have more money. You eat wa Does anybody eat anything other than waffles? I bought this top-of-the-line refrigerator, this top-of-the-line stove, and this mediocre... Microwave. <laughs> I looked at it and was like, what's that magic box? The only thing I use, well, I sometimes use the oven in real life. I mostly use the microwave. <laughs> More old man stories. Because <laughs> I'm lazy and I don't want to walk to where the oven is. <laughs> oh, God. The horror. The horror of the uh, this all. This works much better, though. So somebody destroyed this one, and then Dick built the death one there? Now it's got like a whole theme. I'm not going to remember, but this should have been the thumbnail for the video. This is pretty cool. And they shove that in his... Like, down his spine? Ugh. Our stupid shower's broken again. In two more days, the snowflake day will be upon us. Eat lots of food. Is that the version of Christmas? Stupid liberals taking away Christmas and making it Snowflake Day. They're the snowflakes. You always win when you call someone a snowflake. That means, our, anytime you say that in line, the other person's like, Oh my god, maybe I am. <laughs> Toby's left work today. Is he going to fall asleep on the road? He's exhausted. Bye, Oriole. Thanks for coming to work with me. Wait, we couldn't get food together? Maybe she does work there, too. Maybe she is also a criminal. Maybe that's how they know each other. Oh, go, go, go. She was a ghost all along. That's what I'm going to tell people right now. Or in the future. <laughs> right now, this moment. Do you have a girlfriend? Yeah, she's just a ghost, so you can't see her. But it's perfectly normal. She's got a nice ghost badge. <laughs> Oh, 
classy. We just got like a butt boost from that car right there. <laughs> These classy jokes are probably why no one in my family watches my videos. <laughs> Toby, can you make it to bed? Toby is utterly exhausted. Are you gonna go to bed or are you just gonna stare at Dick? Hit, hit the sack, bro. And I don't mean punch yourself in the crotch, but you can if you want. Are you mad that there are dishes, Dick? There's only one dish, and it's the one in front of Nikki. Are you being a jerk? I hate dirty dishes. The only one here is mine. I haven't had to clean up yet. I hate dirty dishes. Are you thinking of a salad? Are you gonna actually make one? Is somebody gonna eat something other than leftover waffles? Could could that possibly happen? I'm best I'm guessing it's not. Watch Denise come up here and pull some waffles out of here. Wait, what? There was salad in there? Or some sort of stir fry? Autumn salad. Prepare to watch Denise toss yourself. Dick, clean up this dish. You were all mad about dirty dishes earlier, and you're the only one who's left one. Mm -hmm. And when Toby wakes up, he's gonna have to call the repair man. Actually, he'll have to. We'll have him repair this personally. Uh, we can replace it for four hundred twenty-five dollars. No, fifty dollars for a technician. No, we're gonna call the technician. Screw that. We can afford fifty bucks. That is not a bad price. Books, man. I got an idea about reading books. That's how I'm going to fight. Fight crime. I have a feeling Dick's the kind of guy who's like, Yeah, I wrote three ti parking tickets today. <laughs> They're all to children on bicycles. <laughs> you know, I, I got to kind of keep society in line or it's going to be chaos. Denise, why are you touching the stove? How old are you, woman? Do not, do not ruin that snowman, Denise. Do not ruin that snowman. All right, we're gonna have some issues here, girl. How? Why did you ruin Dick Snowman? There was no reason for that. Figure she's wearing a mask and two faces. She's in politics. Yeah, now she pretends she's an angel. Wait, was that her snowman? <laughs> Is it snowman for a snowman? The coat of Habarami? Ha ha Haram? Harambe, the coat of dicks out. <laughs> the ancient coat of dicks out. <laughs> it's Nikki's birthday again. Today she embarks on the next stage of life. Why not buy her a birthday cake? We threw her a party before, but I forgot a cake. She'll just age on her own. Get older, woman. Go to work. You're an adult now. That's what birthdays are. I meant the code of Hamarabe. <laughs> Not Harambe. But that's good too. A dick for a dick. I love that movie. <laughs> it's so heartwarming. Oh, is this going to get spicy? Or they're both want to... No, they both want to take a shower at the same time. So you're just going to stare at each other? You kind of get a shower with it shooting everywhere, right? These guys got to be really nasty. Wait, it said Dick had a good sense of humor? I do not agree with that. Yo, oh, yeah, puke on her, girl. Puke on him, girl. Whatever. I misgendered Dick. Get over it. Ooh, what are you doing? You gonna go talk to Denise? <laughs> Denise, quit trying to puke on Dick. That's gross. <laughs> Back to that seductive Sunday trend thing. I don't need to see it. Don't need to know about it. Oh, sir. man, she's got a case of boob stink. You can see it rolling right off those boobies. What is Lexi's job? Isn't she? Oh, no, she's a paramedic. She's moving up in the world. Denise is getting slowly promoted. Oh, crap. We got bills to pay, too. 
Uh, we will pay those bills when Dick finally wakes up. So we don't have anything else taken by the Repo Man. Those, for the most part, work. this is horrible. Oh, the humanity, the snow manatee. There's a fat manatee somewhere like, did you mean me? No, I didn't. Oh. Oh, look at that. Toby's still happy from his first kiss. Maybe get some more? She might have the same hours as him. It looked like his girl, they're not officially boyfriend, girlfriend, worked at the same place in the same hours. So that would seem convenient if we want to call her up. Is he working today? Um, no. Yes, he is. It's Tuesday. He works Tuesday. Oh, here comes the maid. What's up, maid? Made to order. He's like, shut up. We haven't even made any meth in forever. Isn't that just the way it is? You buy a guitar and it sits in the corner. You buy a meth lab, it sits in the corner. You think, I was going to make a lot of meth with it, but then when I get home from work, I just really am not in the mood to work on making meth. Sometimes you got to just drive yourself if you want, you know, those things you care about. <laughs> I'm not drunk. All right, let's go pay that bill. The maid's freaking out. I could never... This is like a maid's horrible dream. I could never... I could never clean this all. It's constantly getting worse. I, I do... Uh, I make D&D modules, which I sell on drive through RPG, and I do Kickstarters and stuff for them. In fact, I probably have another one going on right now. Ooh, let's invite... Oreo. Wait. She, she got like a sister? She, no, we're going to invite the cats. I guess we'll invite her sister over too. Hey, you want to watch me make up with your sister? It'll be kind of cool. <laughs> sure, we'll be right over. Uh, yeah, well, oh, most of them aren't coming over. That's all right. Can we serve lunch? Uh, well, we'll just serve an autumn salad. That way if she's hungry... There's some food. Toby's gonna be a right proper criminal gentleman. Uh, yeah, oh, that's okay. I take that back. I, he's gonna be creepy. He's gonna be majorly creepy. Oops, my rope f fell open. Feel free to have fun in there. <laughs> if you've never been on a date before, make sure to say that on your first date. Oh, here she is. Oh, and there's the repair girl. Just a second, woman. I'm making salad. Talk about disappointing. I made food. What is it? Salad. Caesar salad? Oh. No. Nope. Lord Kaiser was not here for it. Alright. Let's go say hi to that bitch. She was hungry last time. No, put that, put that plate down. Not on the floor. You invited her over. Yes, there's a door. Go through it. <laughs> what the fuck is the maid doing? No! I just made that... For our guest. Oh. No. Uh. Quit making... Uh. This is going horrible. Okay, we have a limited amount of time before we get to work. So we've got to make this matter. <laughs> Don't put that in the fridge. Don't put... Oh my god. You tried to you sabotage this date, maid. It's not my fault. That the maid The maid was trying to do it. Would you like to massage my wee-wee? I mean, would you like a massage from my wee-wee? <laughs> there you go, girl. Yeah, you, you, the maid's like, looks like I'm done here. He's thinking about a yeti. Looks like you're done trying to screw up Toby's date. You dickweed. Hey, girl. How's it going? Yeah. How about some... I know I'm a little stinky because they haven't fixed the shower yet. But, you know, you want some of my stink on you. It's all good, girl. Let me stroke your cheek. This ain't creepy. I don't know how to do cat noises. Purr, 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 purr. Oh yeah, ladies love that shit. 
I, I think they're fixing the toilet because the toilet was broken. They're not fixing the shower. <laughs> Trying to get some. Well, I hear somebody plunging the shit out of a toilet. <laughs> You're ruining the mood, mate. Or, uh, repair person. Oh, they did repair the shower. Nikki hopped in there. Hey, girl, you want to go in the ice cold pool where Chuck died? Oh, I don't even have to tell them to do it. They're going for it. Yeah, yeah. Dick, don't you ruin this. Oh, crap. Our idiot roommates are coming home from work. Kissy, kissy. Kissy, kissy sounds. Ma, ma, ma. So romantic. Ma, ma, ma. Oh, he's like, I'm really hungry for this salad I made for us, girl. Wait, 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 what? Try for baby. Girl, I'm gonna eat a salad and then once I have some energy, you wanna try for a baby or something? I'm gonna have to go to work before then. <laughs> Where'd she go? Oh, she's outside going to work. On what is this? Someone making an igloo? Whoa, dick. You look like a dork. Wait, why did he... Why did he change into a cop uniform when he got home? Do they not let him wear it at work? Or do they not let him wear it out of the building so he's got to put it on at home to feel like a big man? Uh oh, he's gossiping. He's like, I arrested a six year old today. I tell me, let someone else deal with that dish. Just throw that plate on the ground. Happy birthday to the ground. Uh oh. Congratulations, Lexi's impressive performance has earned her a promotion to medical intern. Doctor or not, there's a long way to go before you'll earn the respect of your peers and the right to use the scalpel on patients. Pay attention to other doctors and study the latest medical journals, or else it's back to the bedpans for you. Hey, you can just visit them when you're bored. I miss you, bedpans. Oh, Dick's making an egg look cool. Hey, girl. Are they just going to stand there? Hey girl, you want to spend the night? We can have a pajama party. We can play Nintendos. I got Super Marios. I got Duck Hunt. Oh yeah, girl. You can Duck Hunt with me all night long. You can raw dog me. He's like, she's like, ooh, that's naughty. I mean, the dog, when it laughs at me, it makes me raw. <laughs> I don't, what else does it mean? Wait, she's like, thank you. I want to spend the night here. Did they fix the computer? Oh my word, the repair person actually did something. That's insane. Toby Hardman just went on his second date with Oreo Bird. If things keep going well, they can make memories together. It's hard imagining that date going any better. I kind of clicked through that quickly, but... Oh, Toby, you can finally stop stinking. She didn't end up wanting to make a baby with him. Maybe she will next time, once he don't stank so bad. <laughs> Well, everybody, that's it for me. Thanks for the hanging around for the adventures of Stank Stankington and his friends. I don't think they're really friends, though. <laughs>